Hey everybody, we are um, we are kind of just shopping around <clears throat> today, looking uh, specifically for um, looking for rugs and just a few things, decorative team things for the house. Uh, the the new house we just moved in is a little bigger than our current place, so. Uh, it's a little little empty so just just looking around at some 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 home good type furniture places decorative places and kind of just looking around uh, we haven't been having much luck though looking for just like a big yeah big area rug for our downstairs area but yeah we are the store we're in is called home home market or world market yeah so we're in world market right now we went to, yeah, it's a nice store. We went to Marshall's and we actually got a nice clock there on Clarence. Real good deal, but didn't find a rug. Oh, there's some rugs over here. Is that a bed? Oh, that thing's cool. Yeah. I like that one right there. Your hand is on. <laughs> it's like <laughs> Jeez. Oh my God. That's huge though. It is. It's colorful. I like this one. I do too. But it wouldn't. It's just blue. Like very blue. Ooh. This one's nice. It is nice. That's a nice rug. Yeah. I think the gray will play off the green. Yeah. How much is it? 150. Oh, what's the six by nine our couch is eight feet so it's longer than our couch that's not bad i like that 150 dollars i don't know if i want to pay the 150 for it that's though the only issue. dang this one is 450 because it's thicker don't yeah i wouldn't pay 450 for that <laughs> I really like that one. This one isn't. It's like, it's different. Ooh. That one's 150 too. If I'm gonna pay 150. Oh, yeah. Yeah, if I'm gonna pay 150. Yeah. Oh, these are like long runners. It's the only that's the only problem with things like the floors like this that stuff's so expensive i mean but it's it's not i guess for that size of the rug it's not that bad i mean that's how much i mean that's how much I actually yeah yeah it's just we had that 50 well, we supposed to have that 50 off. yeah we had a uh we had a gift card that for for ashley's furniture so two years ago when we first bought furniture for our house back in ohio uh, they gave us a gift card for the purchase that we made. And so we haven't used it in a few years. So we, you know, we moved out here, you know, to California and we go to use the $50 gift card and they're like, that's nice. Um, and they're like, you know, you can't use that gift card. Uh, and I guess how Ashley's is set up, it's like some stores are corporate stores and some stores are like franchisee or privately 
own stores that use Ashley Furniture's name. So, <clears throat> so yeah, I and mean, it's a legit gift card and everything. It's just, but they said we couldn't use it at their location. So we're kind of upset about that. Uh, so yeah, they lost a customer and we weren't just buying a rug. Like we were gonna buy end tables and everything there, but yeah. them rejecting us on the gift card. We're just like, okay, well, And then they were gonna everything. give us a $25 off yeah. gift card. And I'm like, well, let's get It's two. like, why don't you, yeah, why don't you lost, you lost all this business because of $50, but. You know. Yeah. I'm hungry, y'all. And look at all this food and candy and stuff. Yeah, we need to get something to eat, man. I'm starving. I really do like that rug, but I don't know if I want to pay 150 for it. Well, we need to take a lunch break. Oh, that's for snow cones. We need to find that thing they had. I'll put it in my kitchen. <clears throat> Yeah, I'll put it in my kitchen. kitchen. For real, like right by the, it'll always be going. Why not? <laughs> one day, I'm telling you, that's one day. Uh, one day. We went this for uh, for the 4th of July, we were over uh, some family's house and they had a, like one of those icy machines that like just keeps spinning and spinning, you know, and it's it, essentially you put the, the, the juice in it and it gets cold to icy form. And they had one of those machines and I thought they rented it but it was actually like their machine, they owned it. And so now I'm like, okay, now we gotta get one of those. And it has to be, not just for special events and special occasions, that needs to be in the kitchen for, you know, everyday use. Like I'm a, I'm a icy and slushy type guy. Yeah. So. Powder room. What is a water closet? Y'all know what a water closet is? $8. Yeah, I don't know what a water closet is, y'all. I've never heard of a water closet. Where would it go, though? Over the bathroom. Is there, talking about like, see it from the living room? That is nice too. I like this. Live well, love much, laugh, laugh often. Live well. Oh. Oh, break it, you buy it. I'm trying to buy it. Oh. Eat. That's what no, that's what this sign says. Oh, I like this. One lost socks. How much is it? Look. It's $50. Let's get it. What? I love it though. That is nice. Lost socks, loads of fun. I'm like sturdy. That is cool. Yeah. Yeah, here's like a little chalkboard thing. I like a little thing. Yeah. Pricey, yeah, it is pretty, pretty expensive. Mm. So I got the, uh, I got the double cheeseburger animal style, and she got the single cheeseburger animal style. So, best burger joint in all the land. No better burger than In and Out. Who better? Well, we went to that um, that burger spot in Roseville. Hmm? Well, we have the jalapeno one. Oh, that one. Really but that, that wasn't a burger spot, though. Uh, what? Islands? Yeah. No, that's not a burger spot. It's mainly burgers. No. And I have other things with me. And I was like a sit down, like this is like fast food. Okay, our fast food. Okay. Just had lunch. Yeah, I talked I told Jazz I think that 
the work of the Lord was really <laughs> it's not it's not recorded in the Bible but on the eighth day after <clears throat> after he created the earth and everything in it and it was out form of void he also spoke chick-fil-a and in and out into existence so um, so yeah that was that was really God like those two restaurants are really God's work for the betterment of people as as a whole what? um you know those those two restaurants i believe was really god's divine plan for our lives um you know so great great awesome place i love i love eating there but yeah we were at we were at uh where we at we at pet smart just looking at some cages we got to get uh <clears throat> this is the one this is the size she would need um, we got to get a cage, another crate for our dog Melanie. She destroyed her last one and has recently done some destroying in the house. But, uh, <clears throat> so yeah, this is, I think we're going to do this one. It's ultra strong, it's like double door. It's what she needs. Um, she needs a pretty strong one. Look how expensive these are, y'all. Man, really? 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 Man, these so expensive. And even for the one, like, if we don't get her this one, like the expensive one, she uh, like destroy it. So it's like, <clears throat> we almost have to do that one. She's too strong. Yeah, she's a strong pit bull, like, I mean, and you know she when she gets scared or afraid like of loud noises or smoke detector or even more recently the fireworks she'll do anything to escape or try to hide and she's destroyed her old cage and <clears throat> <clears throat> so yeah so yeah now we gotta pay 140 dollars to get her something that's more adequate we got a cheap crate. Yeah. Then it turns out we still need to get a crate. After we got her. Yeah. This was this was one of the deciding factors of us actually getting her as a dog. We were like, okay, we want her, but the crates are so expensive, we not gonna do it. You know, we're not gonna get one. And then by the time <clears throat> or no, that's the mat. And then we found a really inexpensive crate and we're like, okay. Now we're going to get her. But then now she destroyed that crate. So we're back at square one where we now are looking for a crate. But we already have the dog now. So, so we have to get her. So yeah, we... All my dog lovers, y'all understand. Dog lovers and dog owners, y'all know the struggle. Things we do for our pets. Things we do for our pets. All right, guys. So we are back home from our... From our adventurous day, we ran to a few other stores um, while we were out. But now we're back home, we're grocery shopping. And uh, so now we're here. You guys haven't seen yet. I'll do it. Um, they haven't seen the house? Yeah, haven't really seen the house. Um, so I'll do a walkthrough. Probably when we get a few more things set up and get stuff more together but um i mean just kind of just just quickly i mean this is just our downstairs kind of messy right now um and we still got stuff that we got to put up and on the walls and all that stuff um but yeah we're getting there so yeah that's, that's the downstairs area say hi say hi tank and nico hi Say hi. Tank and Nico says hello, and here's Melanie chilling right here. She's scared of the camera, y'all. Y'all know she don't like the camera. You can go ahead and lay back down. You can go lay back down. Yeah, she don't. She don't deal with that. Yeah, she's she's afraid of a lot. Seriously. She's afraid of a lot. So I wonder. And she's a dog that we got from the shelter. So I really wonder, you know, what may have happened, or you know, if it was. I don't know what it may have been with her past that you know has her scared of a lot of things. Um, so yeah, 
We've got the watermelon. Um, I've been really slacking. I used to love fruit and like when I grew up, uh, I always had fruit in my house being young, but as I become an adult, I really yeah. haven't eaten much fruit, you know? So so we, we ate a watermelon. We got a watermelon and um, ate it last week. And it was pretty good. It was all right. So got another one and some cantaloupe. Um, strawberries. And strawberries. So do a little bit more eating of fruit. Good snack food. We need to go to Costco. They got really good fruit. Yeah, we need a, a Costco a membership. Um, I get one through discount at my job, but I, I still haven't set that up. So we'll probably get a membership at Costco, get some things, you know, pretty good discount. Y'all see my plan over here? It was also struggling at the old house. I think because the lighting. So I had it like in a window, and I think the window was. It was too much sunlight, so now I have it out of direct sunlight, and it's kind of just chilling here, and it's in the way, so I'm watering it more frequently, frequently than it was before. Uh, before it was in our guest room, and I, you know, went in there rarely, so I rarely watered it. Probably once or once a week, but by it being, or maybe sometimes twice a week, but by it being in the window, I think it dried it out a lot faster because it was so much light coming through that window. I thought. That was the better, you know, the best place to put it, but it wasn't. So I think it actually has looked like it's doing a little better. Yeah. Um, I think it's like it's a few of these pieces well, are growing. Out. Yeah, the pieces that are dead are, are wrapped, but um, but like there's some stuff here that's like I've seen grown within the past few days and some new things. So I'm trying to get my little, my green thumb. See how we do. We do it, Henry. That's the name of the plant. The plant's name is Henry. What? I think I didn't know the plant name was Henry. I didn't. Yes, you did. Yeah. Everybody know the plant's name is Henry. <laughs> Everybody know the plant's name is Henry. But, uh, yeah, Jasmine's about to cook dinner. Um, we making what? What is it? Parmesan. It's a Parmesan crusted tilapia. So. Before she's, it's the fish, and um, we'll see. I don't think. Have you ever made this before? No. 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 Yeah, never made this before. So, so. Just like bread it, tilapia, but just like parmesan cheese. Well, yeah, parmesan crusted. Yeah. So we'll see. So it should be be a new, a new thing. The thing is, is that you like it. I'm pretty picky. Yeah. I'm pretty picky. I don't know. That's the question. And then we got a got a clock from for ten dollars, y'all. Ten dollars for this clock at Marshalls. So I'm gonna put that up. Actually, I'm gonna put it right there, that first landing right there. So I'm gonna put the clock up there. Um, yeah. So like, I think I'm gonna do a separate video um, of just like the walkthrough. I may do it within. I may put it up within the next few days. Just a walkthrough of the house. There's gonna be a few other improvements. Oh, okay, you can't see me. Um, how about now? Now you can see me. There's gonna be a few other uh, improvements, like they're gonna be getting the carpet and stuff replaced. Uh, I think it's gonna be laminate downstairs, then carpet upstairs replaced, and a few other things. So, uh, but yeah, I, I, and we're, like I said, we're still adding some things. Add, but I like it. I like the house a lot better than our last one. It was really, you know, maybe a blessing in disguise. You know, because our last one we really didn't want to move, but um, but the owners sold the house. You know, so we had to go, and we found something that really I believe suit us a lot better, and uh, you know, allow us to grow, grow more. You know, when it, if you know if we decide to to have kids soon and all that good stuff. So I, I do. I really like this place. I don't feel like. The other house was a ranch style, and it was a little bit smaller square footage. Well, a good amount smaller in square footage. So we're almost felt like on top of each other, and especially when people came to visit. So, so yeah, been chilling. Been chilling today. Been off work. Me and Jasmine actually had today off together, which is pretty rare. We rarely have, especially on the weekday um, days. On the you know, I, well, I'm rarely off on a weekday. I'm, I'm, I work Monday through Friday. Uh, but I, I took a few vacation days this week, so um, 
So yeah, we're off today and just doing some errands and running around. It just feels good to not have to, you know, do any, not have to be at work. Um, still working, still editing vlogs and getting stuff uploaded. I'm behind y'all, I'm behind with the videos. So I'm trying to get them uploaded as fast as I can and um, get them out to you and push them out. So appreciate you for your support and your love and uh, you watching and uh, yeah. If I don't talk to y'all later, I will say our deuces now. Um, I think I, I'm gonna do a few more things around the house and then we're gonna eat and just chill and enjoy one another. Enjoy our day off. So, um, so I'll talk to you guys later. Appreciate you for watching. Talk to you. Messing yourself up the whole time.